So we're switching from Disneyland to the Disneyland um, California Adventure Park. So we're going here simply because there's so many more, so many more rides and stuff like that here, like bigger ones. I was screaming on the last one, and that was nothing in comparison to what we're about to go on. So there's literally skyscrapers, and I'm I'm fearing for my life because I'm not good with rides, but I'm excited. <laughs> I'm excited to do it, but I don't know. I'm happy. This place is amazing. Everything is everywhere. Like, I think it's time to get food. I think it's time to get food. <laughs> I'm starving. All I've had is a churro. I'm struggling right now. I don't have a bag, so I'm carrying everything for like a fucking coat hanger right now. While we eat, I gotta dry the shoes. And the jumper, and the jumper, and the bag. No, not really, not really a bag, but. Because things are soaked, my feet are covered in. Look, you can see that. This is drenched. I'm struggling. So, just walking into the Grand Canyon, it feels. We're in the Grand Canyon, babe. Oh, yeah, that's the car drive. Are you racing with other people? Oh, wow. This is awesome. Good 66. Log jokes, I'm in Disneyland. I realise we messed up a little bit. We should have probably bought a few more days here. There's two parks, they're both as big as each other and they're massive, so we're trying to scrounge around and trying to get everything done, but at the same time, it's like how do, how do you get everything done in 12 hours when there's literally two massive parks? And then, like two-hour lines for every single thing that's going on. So we can't wait. We can't wait at every single one, but we're gonna try to get as much done as physically possible. But like, it's really hard. It's not. It's not. It's not easy. So we're gonna try our best. See how we go. Hopefully, we get on that thing behind me. You can you can see the Ferris wheel behind me now. So we're trying to get on that before we go on the big roller coaster. I'm trying to not look too much at the roller coaster because I don't want to give anything away. But I'll probably have to use the GoPro on that one. I won't be able to use this camera at all, or else it will fly. Well, this is the one we're going on. We're going on the swing one. There's like a non-swinging and a swinging. I think it's like a 30 minute wait time, but this looks crazy. The other people are boring, they're just chilling. So we're not being boring, we're going on this one right here. <laughs> I don't want to do this, man, but we're doing it. We're doing it. We're not backing out. <laughs> I'm going to die. I'm going to die. This vlog ends here. I'm done.
So we just got off that roller coaster. Oh my god. <laughs> you could probably hear me screaming that whole time, but that was that was intense. Oh can't even breathe. <laughs> <laughs> you can see the footage, I, I put it up before this bus. Oh my god. That is probably the fastest roller coaster I'll ever go on. I'm not gonna lie. I'm, I'm not a roller coaster guy. That that was pretty pretty fucking intense and <laughs> I have no words. I have no words. I'm dead. I'm dead. As I was walking out I dented my I dented my lens as well. In just in the corner. Luckily it didn't get anything too too serious but could have been fatal, could have been fatal on this trip. I didn't really want to damage my camera, but it's hard It's hard to juggle everything, especially when you don't have a backpack. I fucked up and didn't bring a backpack, so. If you come to Disneyland, definitely, definitely bring a backpack or something, because I tried to buy one, it was like $75. I ain't gonna pay $75, for, and it was a female's backpack. I ain't, I ain't paying that price, no way. So we just waited that soaring across the world, really cool experience, so pretty much strap you in, suspend you from the air, they spray wind on you, I mean, spray scents, all that type of stuff, just to make you feel like you're in the moment. And I honestly thought like I was gonna die. <laughs> it felt like I was like a thousand feet in the air, but it's really cool. Like, they have a lot of different experiences here. I definitely suggest getting more than one day because we're not gonna see everything, which is quite unfortunate, but we'll get as much as we can done. I think this place is open till 9 p.m. and then Disneyland's open till 11 p.m. So we'll definitely be here until 11 p.m probably over that to be honest but we're going to Carland now I think and then after that we're going to Guardians of the Galaxy so that should be awesome so we're in line for I think an hour and 45 minutes <laughs> to go on this car's ride I think this place is open to nine I think we have two more places to go to so this one and Guardians of the Galaxy as I said before but it's got to be a long time so we're downloading Pictionary to kill time because two hours in a line is fucking ridiculous. I think it's like 40, no, it's like an hour in and I'm struggling right now. I can't even feel my feet. Help me. So I just went on cars, really good production quality, like everything here is really, really well constructed and just crazy to go down, so obviously I showed that before, now we're trying to rush to Guardians of the Galaxy, I want to get as many rides in as possible, don't have any fast passes, I don't understand the, the whole fast pass thing, because you pay for a fast pass, but you can get only a limited amount of rides in the fast pass, it doesn't really make sense, but we're trying to rush there now, I don't know if we're going to make it or not, but... I think it's like 8 o'clock, you can't even see me, it's that dark, but we're going to rush, if I can get it, I'll get it on my GoPro and then we'll go from there. Last one of California Adventure Park, man this is going to be 
pretty hard to get into, but we'll give it a shot, see how we go. I don't know. I, I have a feeling it's like a giant drop equivalent of Australian like Dream World. I'm excited. I've never been this excited about thrill rides before, but Guardians of the Galaxy. Okay. Um, it's a movie about like boxing. They they box. They <laughs> it's a type of yeah. It's a really famous boxing movie. No, pass. Fight Club. No. It's a type of computer that's not Windows. Apple. Yeah, but like the name for it. Mac. Yeah, Apple with Mac. a with a letter in front of the Mac. My Mac. Yep. Um, it's a question that you would ask me if I was a little kid going into a, a haunted mansion. It's what? A question that you would ask me if I was a little scared? kid, sort of, close. Are you afraid? Of? Are you afraid of ghosts? No. Are you afraid of the dark? Yep, there you go. Oh. Uh, nah, pass. <laughs> nah, pass. Pass. Oh man, you're on a... Uh, it's the cartoon that you always watch. Family Guy, South Park? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> That's it. Oh, We're almost there. I think we have like... I think it's 9 5 I think we've been in lines for like four hours. It's almost been four hours of lines. I've only, only been on one ride so far, so... We should have done that hack. I know there's a hack for fast pass and stuff. It's okay, it's okay. Hopefully we can get back into Disney World. Hopefully there's a Disney World, Disneyland. And hopefully there's a few more rides there. Obviously we've got a fast pass for Pirates of the Caribbean, I think, or Indiana Jones, one of those two, but... We're almost finished up here. It's been an awesome day, but just... It's really, really, really long lines. I highly suggest if you come to Disneyland, just make sure you have fast passes for everything or else you're just going to be sitting in line for so, so long.
So I just went on the Gardens of the Galaxy. <laughs> if I knew it was a giant drop like equivalent, I would not have even participated in that. But um, I feel like my legs, <laughs> my legs are literally jelly right now. But we're missing the fireworks at Disney. So I might just close it here for one second so we can run to these fireworks because I don't really want to miss out on the fireworks at Disney World, especially when I'm only here for one day. We are jogging, everyone's running to get to rides and everyone's leaving as well. Yeah, I think everyone's leaving because of the the fireworks are over, but we're still we're still partying, I guess, until until the AM. I'm trying to get through this traffic. But we have to go on Indiana Jones. There's a lot of stuff we haven't seen here, but like, yeah, I see why people say you need a couple of days to go through all this because I'm really struggling. I don't know if you, even know if you can see me because it's so dark here, but I am seriously struggling so bad. But low key, this place is pretty lit. I don't even know if you can see me, but we just made, I think it's like 9, yeah, 9.51. 9.51 at the moment, so we're just getting through the fast bus now. It's been a long day. It's been a really long day. Get me there so we can party like it's 1957. Oh. Indiana Jones, boy, coming at ya, coming at ya. Pretty spooky, babe. Pretty spooky, bro. There's some, there's some drinks. Oh, this is the exit. It says exit. Okay. Are we leaving? Do we just walk in to leave? Oh, no, it's excellent. Thank you. Not bad. It is unlike anything you have ever Fast seen. Fast Pass is literally a godsend. It is a godsend. It would take so long to wait in line. It would take so long to wait in line for the shit. So it, thank God for this. Thank God for the world. She booked this one perfectly. So we're getting in there. I've gone on a lot of rides that I never thought I'd go on, but we're doing it now. So still alive, boys. Still alive. So we are literally rushing everywhere right now. That was awesome. Indiana Jones one was awesome. Highly recommended if you come here, but we have to literally go A wall. We have to we got I think two more rides we want to be on and it's like almost ten o'clock, so it's gonna be a struggle but we're gonna run as fast as we can. These little legs do move sometimes. Let's go! that time has come Disneyland's over kind of sad excited for the Universal Studios but we didn't get everything done here <clears throat> it's a good excuse to come back here but obviously our day our trip ends in like what two days three days so it's sad but I really enjoyed it really had like a lot of fun here nostalgic everything like that I went to a lot of things that are nostalgic this trip to be honest back to the beach was nostalgic this is nostalgic and I don't know it's it's cool to go to places like this and just and just unwind and I don't know shit yourself at the same time as well. guys love close-ups of my face so I'm gonna keep doing them but I'm gonna sign off here I am rooted and not in the good way um, Disneyland was amazing but you definitely need more days not gonna lie if you if you come here <coughs> I would definitely suggest getting like a three-day pass or something like that it's just way too hard if you if you come here for one day you're running around you're trying to get everything done and like we got not a lot done I think we got like four rides out so it's not a lot in comparison because like two parks there's a lot oh my god why is it not tingling but there's a lot of parks i mean a lot of rides not enough time i thought 13 hours would be enough but 
It definitely is not. We didn't get a lot of photos. Obviously, we didn't get all the photos we wanted either. So we'll definitely have to come back 2020 to see Coachella and Disneyland. But thank you for watching. Subscribe if you like like the uh, the vlog. Let me know what you think of Disneyland if you've been here before. I personally enjoy it a lot. Obviously, being from the two like the 1990s, Disneyland's like a I don't know. You know everything. You know everything about Disney when you're from the 1990s, to be honest. But thank you for the support. I appreciate all the support, and I will see you next video. GVN, play that back, boy.